6B, this is REZ 2018-14, Coventry Villas, it's located at Mulligan Road, RA to R1, or RA and R1 to PD, has county water and sewer and involves 8.57 acres. Ms. Braswell. Yes, Mr. Chairman, yes, this is a request for a planned development. Um, the development would consist of up to 35 single-family residential dwellings. Um, you have in your packet the applicant site plan. Um, the applicant has worked diligently with staff to address the concerns of the neighbors. with the developer to, to do that. Um, other updates included um, a landscape buffer against the neighbors. They were pleased with that. And um, the last update was that of an admin waiver granted to lots five and six um, to go from a 30-foot setback to a 24-foot setback. Um, concerning the future development map, such property is included in the urban service area and is in a suburban area, character area. Um, planned development is um, supported in that character area, and you have staff's recommendation as well as the planning commission, and we believe this project will be ready for your consideration on tomorrow. Any question for Ms. Braswell? What are the subdivisions? These are, these are roughly about 5,000 square foot lots. That is correct. What other subdivisions in the county have the, roughly those similar lots? Do you know? Um, anywhere from 10,000 square feet on, on down, you have a planned development um, that is adjacent to this property on the east side, and those lots run about 8,000 square feet. So this, this is a little different, a um, little tighter. <laughs> Do we have anything on the county like this now? 5,000. The only one that comes to mind would be Nelson Hill. Okay. Um, I believe those lots are actually smaller than 5,000 square feet. Okay. Any other questions? <clears throat> so that subdivision to the east is 8,000 square foot lots. 8,000 square feet. Glen Laurel. Yes, sir. Thank you. Okay, if there's no other questions, we'll move on to a